Hey, what is up gamers? Gamer Gal here, and welcome back to Amori. Alright, so, we're gonna go in the church, kick Aubrey's ass, and then get Kel- uh, er, uh, Bezo's book back. That is a sentence I never thought I'd say in my life, but here we are. <laughs> and, and like Kel just said, well, here we are. Australia's the last place I would expect her. I'm kind of skeptical, actually. It might be a trap. I'll open the door a little to take a peek. Squee! Hmm. That's normal with me. I think they're in the middle of a sermon. Oh, there's she is on the right. Hmm, she's just sitting there, all normal. So weird. Yeah, I feel pretty bad about interrupting this. We should probably wait until the sermon is over or something. Ah, well then. Well, <laughs> back and forth, back and forth. What do we do now then? What do we? Is, hold on, Nick. Let's wait here until the sermon is over. Well, we literally just have to wait here. You want to go inside the church? Well, okay, let's look around then, I guess. I don't know if this game has like a wait thing. Always old blue bag. Huh. Fairway Cemetery. Is it, what does the other one say? Fairway Cemetery? Yep. Can we go there? No? Such a religious figure. Feels as if he's judging you. Hmm. Well, I'm bored. The only way to progress. Whoa. Whoa, I didn't expect you to just walk in like that, Nick. Well, there's no turning back now. Come on, we have to be really quiet. Yeah, no talking to no one. Ooh. Yeah, be real quiet. There she is on the right. Let's walk to the pew behind her. Those photo album. You're still on about that? It's none of your business. I don't know why I'm whispering. Really? None of my business? We all used to be best friends, but now this is none of my business. Yeah, Kel. Exactly. We used to be best. We used to be friends. Oh, okay. Is this like the future? What happened to Amari then? You know, Mari would be really sad to hear that. Heh. <laughs> really? You really want to bring Mari into this? Who cares what Mari thinks? Mari's dead. Oh my god. What? Aubrey, seriously? What's wrong with you? Oh, now he's being loud. I get that you have new friends now, but you can't just forget your old ones like that. My old friends? My old friends weren't there for me when I needed them. What? I I'm sorry? Yes, we were? So that's what this is all about. When Mari passed on... We were all dealing with our own stuff. Ah, we were kids. It was hard. I think it's all so simple. You've always been simple, Kel. So what if I am? I'd rather be simple than be like you. How could you do that to Bazil? You know how important his photo album is to him? It's important to all of us. That doesn't mean you can just steal it. Is that what Bazil told you? I'm the one keeping it safe. What are you talking about? That photo album belongs to Brazil, and I'm not leaving until you agree to give it back. Ugh. You're so persistent. When Mari died, you moved on so fast. You know why I come here every week? Even after all this time, I'm still trying to fi find some peace. But it doesn't look like that's happening today. We haven't talked in four years, Kel. A lot changes in four years. You and Nick think you can just barge back into my life and tell me what to do? Don't be so naive. You might look different and act different, Aubrey, but you're still the same person. Hmm. The Aubrey you knew is long gone. And the Aubrey that was your friend, she's long gone too. Jesus Christ. Okay, fine. I get that you're angry. Look, if it's an apology you want, here. I'm sorry, okay? I should have been there for you when we lost Mari. Jeez, for once, Kel's being the mature one. Y you gonna say it? No. I won't accept this. Wait! Where are you going? I can't let you go until you promise me you'll give Bazil his photo album back, you thief. What's happening? Bazil? Isn't that the boy who... 
I've seen Opry and her friends bully. Now she's stealing as well. Oops. Oh, wow. Now she's being judged by everyone in the church. You think you're the good guy, don't you, Kel? And I'm the big bad bully. Here to terrorize poor defenseless Brazil. You're the one hanging out with the psychopath who carries around a knife. Now's not the time to do this, Aubrey. You don't get to say that. You're the one who barged in here. I already said I was sorry for everything. If you want me to be a bully, then I'll be a bully! You two better come at me quick, or I'll come at you first! Oh boy. Well, time to fight. Oh, I do not have a lot of health. Yeesh. Um. Let's, um. Shit. I should have bought. Okay, if I die, I need to go back to the health place. In. But how am I gonna get the money? Well, might as well just attack. Well, I don't have a knife anymore. Ah, uh, yep, and there he goes. Look at her clothing. It is so completely in it is completely inappropriate for church. Wow, people are judging her while we're fighting. Ow! Yeah, I'm definitely gonna die. Can't believe she would bring a weapon in here. How uncivilized. Damn. Spits on my shoe. Bruh. What do these delinquents think they're doing? This is a place of worship. Oh, and there I go. Hmm. Serves you right, Kel. Now, leave me alone. Am I gonna get to see a game over screen? Uh, ever since her father left, she's so uncontrollable. Maybe I wasn't supposed to beat her. Disrespectful. I feel bad for her mother. Oh, wow. The whispering. Oh, and there she goes. Would something different happen if I beat her? Shoot. I know she's been kind of messed up lately, but I still feel sorry for her. Maybe this was a bad idea. Well, let's get the F out of here. All these people judging. Uh. Oh, this guy's so pretty. I never noticed before because, well, it never showed. We should go... Um... To Aubrey's house? Which one is Aubrey's house? I'm just gonna pick the colorful ones. No response. Didn't you say the church was right next to our house? Oh, don't tell me that's Aubrey. Yeah, that's Aubrey's house. Oh boy. What did you just throw away? I heard paper. Did you just throw away the photo album? Well, let's dig in the trash. Did you see that? Opera just dumped something into her trash can. Let's go check it out. How much would I bet it's a photo album? Oh, Kel. Oh, I didn't. I don't believe it. It's Brazil's photo album. Called it. I did believe it. I can't believe she just throw it out like that. It's a good thing we looked through this trash can. But on the bright side, at least we have Brazil's photo album now. And it only took us half a day, too. Talk about teamwork. How about a high five, Nick? Hell yeah, I do! <laughs> he's so freaking energetic. Just bah! Let's give this back to Brazil before it gets dark. He'll be so happy when he sees it. No response. Ah. Uh, well. Brazil's house is... Yes. Kitty cat on the roof! Why well, you gotta get knock the door? Knock knock! Brazil! It's your friends killing Nick! Oh. Oh, hello there. Who are you? Hi, Brazil. Oh, wait. You're not Brazil. Oh, I'm sorry. My name is Polly. I'm Brazil's caretaker. Brazil? Oh, hey, Kel. What is it? Hi, Brazil. We got your photo album back. Uh huh? You did? Wow. Thank you. You gave Brazil back his photo album. Yeah. Brazil, you didn't tell me you had friends coming over. Would you like to join us for dinner? I always seem to cook to you just a, just a little too much. I stumbled like a mother effer on that sentence. Dinner? Sure, sounds delicious. Who's calling me? Random number, shut up. Come on, Nick, free dinner. 
Isn't dinner always free when you're living at home? Parents cook for you? Well... Yeah, I don't know how, how Kel's living situation is, so... Please make yourself at home. I'll go ahead and finish up the food. Wow, it's been a while since I've been in here. You definitely have a lot more plants than you used to. Didn't Pizzo say you had a grandma? Uh, yeah, I like them a lot. Actually, there's some that are still alive from when you guys came here more often. Well, you sure are dedicated. Yep, that's Brazil for you. Flowers and photos. <laughs> oh, that reminds me. Now that we got your photo album back, we can all go through the photos together. Uh, that's, uh, I don't know. It's been a while since you've looked through them, hasn't it? Come on, it'll be fun. Um, sh sure, okay. Here it is. Let's look! Ooh. Aw. My first photo. It's my best friend Nick trying out his new violin. He's starting to take lessons again so he can play at recitals with his sister Mari. So exciting. Hmm. Is Nick... Yeah, d Nick is definitely in the place of Amori. Just Kel being Kel. So many party hats. <laughs> Nick playing a video game on the couch. Nick is a little shy, but he's a really good listener. I always end up venting to him when I get upset or stressed. Sometimes I feel like I'm bothering him, but he never seems to mind. We're back from the park, but Kel is still full of energy. He challenged Harrow to an arm wrestling match, but we all know he's going to win. Please go easier on him, Harrow. <laughs> Oof, sorry, Kel. Better look next time. Aw. <laughs> Kel was still feeling a little sour about losing a hero in arm wrestling last night, so Hero decided to lean in for a smooch. Kel looks so annoyed. Ah, perfectly love. Wait, that seems familiar. Me showing Nick a book I've been reading. Or I stole my camera so I took and took this when I wasn't paying attention. I should really keep better track of my things. Aww. It's all of us cuddling with Nick's stuffed animals. He has so many, and they're all so soft. I wish I could just lay here forever. Aww. Mari's teaching everyone how to make flower crowns. Here's Nick and Kel holding Mari's example. It looks perfect, doesn't it? If only Mari thought so, too. Mmm, these are familiar. Harry's still making his flower crown. It's taking him a little while, but he's getting there. You have to admire his persistence. It's raining super hard today. The rain always seems to come out of nowhere during springtime. Aubrey asked me to take a picture of her with her new raincoat. It's her favorite color, pink. Aw. Aubrey won't let Kel under the umbrella, but Kel seems to be taking it just fine. He says he likes how the rain tastes. <laughs> just Kel being Kel again. We went to Hobbies, but the shop owner told Kel to leave his jacket outside since Kel was getting all his comics wet. Sorry, shopkeep. It's been pretty busy with school lately, but we finally made time to get together and go to the park today. Here's Kel hanging by his legs off a tree. He's such a good climber. I wish I was as fearless as him. There's a lot of pictures of Kel. Oh, this one's familiar. It was the first day of summer vacation, so we all wanted to celebrate by going to the beach. Watermelon is Aubrey's favorite. Kel cooling off for some refreshing orange gel. I shouldn't get too close or anything and get my camera wet. Kel is known to spill his drinks. <laughs> we buried Nick in the sand. It took forever, but he looks like he's enjoying himself. I wonder if he's going to need help getting out. I guess I'll keep him company until then. Yay, Nick is turning 12 today. Even though me, Nick, Aubrey, and Kel are in the same school year, Nick is younger than all of us. He's the baby of the group, so we have to take care of him. Aw, that's so cute. Nick holding a super huge present from Mari and Harrow. Hmm, I wonder what it is. <laughs> you can't really tell from the photo, but Mari and Harrow got Nick a giant building block set. Nick seems much more interested in the box, though. He acts just like Mari's new kitten, Muo. Muo, wait a minute. That's the cat in the white space. Nick won't leave the box, so Kel put a food bowl inside. I guess the box will be Nick and Muir's no home. Aw. We're going beto catching today. Here's Kel, ready to pounce on his next victim. Oh, and Nick is there too. He looks kind of sleepy. Aw. I went to the bathroom and came back to this photo. Kel says he took a picture of himself on accident, but I don't believe him. It's the first day of school today. Me, Nick, Kel, and Aubrey are bright and early. Aubrey's so photogenic. <sighs> Goodbye, Summer. Until next year. Aw, that was all of them? Oh, empty spaces with descriptions? I can't look. Oh, oh well. Are you done looking? Yes, I am. I looked at all the photos. Oh man, it looks like a lot of the photos are still missing. Ah, 
Maybe I'll recap them for herself. We'll have to get those back later. On the bright side, look how short I was. Haha. <laughs> I know I've grown at least a foot since Harold left for college. I can't wait until he comes back. This year I'll finally be taller let be the taller brother. Haha. <laughs> we'll see about that. Yeah, so Harold is Cal's brother. How about that? Anyway, don't forget about the missing photos, Brazil. Me and Nick will take care of things for you. Oh, hold on! Aubrey was so upset that everyone wasn't there for her when Mari freaking died, but Mari was freaking Nick's sister, so like, uh, show a little sympathy. Like what? Anyway, you just focus on getting, but going back to your happy, carefree self. Okay. Thank you. I'll try. Ah. Food is ready. I'm actually a little here myself. Sorry about the wait. Dinner is taking longer than I thought. Would any of you boys like to help? Yeah, sure, I'll help. I'll get, I got some experience helping my brother cook and stuff. Oh, that would be lovely. Please follow me. The kitchen is this way. It's literally right there. It's not that hard. Well, oh, 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 okay. Got a little stuck there. Hi, Bazil. Uh oh, hi, Nick. Hi, buddy. Ooh, I'm gonna do a little bit of a savey. Yes, please. Boop, boop. Yeah. Okay. Tonight for dinner, we'll be making chicken vegetable soup. How's that sound? Soup and veggies? Sounds nutritious and delicious. Y you really think so? I was so afraid you'd be a bit disappointed. People always tell me that my taste is a bit bland. Don't worry about what other people think. All food is good to me. I'll eat anything you throw at me. And then we'll be ready soon. Please feel free to make yourself at home. I'm gonna go explore stuff. Plants. Some potted plants. Got it. Alright. Shoe rack. Flowers. 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 Heh <laughs> Bunch of books, most of them are about gardening and indoor plant care. Hmm, I wonder whose books those are. Bunch of books, most of them about, yeah, yeah, dang. Two shelves full. Cactus, sturdy and resilient. Can, I wanna look at the TV. Let me look at the TV. No, okay. Uh, couch. No, okay. I'm gonna go, um, uh, refrigerator. Open it. What's inside? Cabbages, carrots, mushrooms, and tofu. Ooh, delicious. Some photos of Brazil and his parents. You've never met them before. Hmm. Oh. There's Brazil's grandma. Brazil's grandma is breathing steadily. Aw. What is this? Oh. So pretty. A white egg red orchid. And the language of flowers it symbolizes the phrase, My thoughts will follow you into your dreams. Aw. Ah. Uh. Hi, Bizzo. Oh, Nick. I didn't expect you to see you in here. Haha. <laughs> um. Is this awkward? I'll leave, sorry. Uh, how are you doing, Nick? Is everything okay with you? Yeah, I'm doing fine. Okay, N never mind then. Oh. Forgot I don't talk. Grandpa Grandma can't hear us, you know. She hasn't been feeling well very very well lately. Aw, Bizzo. It's already been four years, hasn't it? Awkward silence. It's nice to see that you're still around, even if it's only for a little while. Yeah, about that, I'm kind of leaving town tomorrow. Here, take my photo album. I want you to have it. Well, really? I'm trusting you with it, okay? I just think you can probably use it more than me. I'll keep it safe! I promise! Oh. A lot has happened since these pictures were taken. Sometimes it feels like it was all a bad dream. It's hard to remember now, but I think at the time, I took photos of what I was most afraid to lose. Aw, flipping through this album, you can still see the good times. Maybe one day, things can go back to the way they were before. Maybe. Nick! Bazil! Dinner's ready! Ah, well then, I didn't get to explore the rest of the house. Okay, coming! Ah, oh well. Well, I'm coming too then. I don't need to explore the rest of the house. Hot food! Yeah! Following kills homemade dinner. Would you like to eat some? Hell yeah! Take a little seat. Papa squat. <laughs> Look at a kill going. Everything tastes so good. You're the best, Polly. Oh, it's nothing. I'm just following Grandma's recipes. Thanks for your help, Kel. Munch, munch, munch. So as I was saying before, Polly, tomorrow, my older brother Harris finally coming back from college. My mom's all crazy right now, preparing the house and everything. Don't want to be anywhere near that mess. Although... I'm pretty excited to see him. Every time he comes back, the first thing we do is compare heights. This year's the year. Then I'm finally gonna be taller than him. I can feel it in my bones. Aw. Well, I'm leaving tomorrow, so hope maybe I'll see him before I go. 
You and your brother seem close. That's good. Family is important. Oh, hey. What you doing with Bizzo's photo album there, Nick? Uh-oh. I... I gave it to him. I just thought he should have it. Whoa, really? That's so cool of you. Makes sense. Especially since Nick's moving away and all. What? Nick's m moving? Oh, no, he didn't know. Oh, yeah, I thought I already mentioned it. I must have forgot. He's moving in three days, I think. Oh, three days left. I thought tomorrow I was late. Huh. Sorry, I thought you already knew. Oh, three days left. That's why it's called three days left. Oh, jeez. Uh oh. Uh, no, I guess I must have missed it. S sorry, um, maybe, it may I be excused? I, I have to go to the bathroom. Oh. Wait, Bazil! What's up with him? Well, that's just how it is. When you gotta go, you gotta go. I don't think that's the reason he left. I'ma go check on him. Which but which room is the bathroom? This one, apparently. Everything is going to be okay. Everything is going to be okay. Oh no, everything is going to be okay. Everything is going to be okay. Bazil! Uh-oh, it's you, Nick. You're here. I'm so glad. You... you can see it too, can't you? Something... behind you. Um... oh shit, this is what in the... Nick... why... why do you look so scared? Um... Wait... P please Nick, don't leave me. Not again. Oh, Bazil... No, I don't wanna leave! Um, hey, something's up with Brazil. He's having a little bit of an anxiety attack, and also demons. Oh, hey, Nick. I think it's about time we went home. It's way past my curfew. So, yeah, anyway, Polly, if you ever need me, here's my address. I live just down the block. Thanks, Kelly, you're sweet. <laughs> oh, it's nothing. Say goodbye to Brazil for me. <sighs> Welp. Oh, it's nighttime. Oh boy. I don't like the dark. The dark is scary in this game. Um. I forgot where I left for a second. Hold up. It's here, isn't it? Yes. Right? This is my house, because it has the picture make best pick. Well, wait, hold up, Nick. I know it's been a while. Oh. Oh. Well, I thought I was just dropping you off. Alright, I guess. Well, sure, fine. Whatever. Hey, Nick. Thanks for hanging out with me today. Sorry for all the trouble. That was a pretty crazy adventure, huh? I can tell you haven't talked to anyone in a while, but that's okay. It just takes practice. Anyway, Harris can move back from college tomorrow, so I'm sure he'll want to see you before you leave. So if you don't mind, I'll be coming back for you again in the morning. Yeah, of course. Good night, Nick. Sweet dreams. Aw, thanks, buddy. What the hell was that? The whispering was already unsettling. Oh, dear lord in heaven. Um. Could you maybe not with the... Oh, Jesus. Um. Is there anywhere that doesn't have bugs? Why the hell? Um, okay. Giant spider will blocks the doorway. Yeah. Let's pick up that knife. Because why not? Jesus! Spider! God, I hate bugs. Can I cut that now with the knife? Yep. Oh, Jesus. Um. Okay. What the hell is that? Wait, no, what the hell is that? Wait. What the hell? I want a go door! Whatever, you know what? I don't, I don't, I'm good, man, honestly. Oh... Back to this again, huh? The long freaking stairway up to the next level. Something better than- Ew. Ugh, this is- Ew! Ugh, I stepped on a spider. Okay. Ah! Oh god, I hate this. Ow! Uh, you serious? Bro! 
Ow! Stop! God damn! Oh. Oh. Just calm down. Oh. He's scared. Don't be scared, Nick. Just, just get him. Oh, that one didn't even squish. Stop! Stop stabbing me! Oh, Jesus. You again. What the hell are you? Are you the cause of all this? Is that supposed to be, like, symbolic? Like, all this demon shit is, like, depression? I'm gonna stab you! Mother effer, you're causing all this shit. And he's gone. Uh. Mari? You're a ghost. Ah! And she's gone. Oh my god, what is that? Jesus! Stop! I don't like the horror! I wanna go back to the queue! Oh, dear lord in heaven, this shit again? Um... No, I need to calm down first. Calm down! Deep breath. <sighs> Nick calms down. Natural, okay. Nick speed fell, alright. Well, you, something, die. Something's trying to talk to you. No. I just detected nothing. Uh, um. Ow. Fight him. I just detected nothing. This is getting nowhere fast, huh, Nick? Stop. I don't like its smile. It seems like there's a lot going on. You need to block out the little things and figure out what's important. You clear your mind and remember how to focus. Hmm. Huh. Focus. <sighs> Deep breath. Nick focuses. Is everything back to normal now? Oh uh, yes, there was just one little spider. Die, you piece of shit. Okay, time to go to sleep. Because God knows I need it. Very uncomfortable bed. Yes, I would like to sleep, please. Oh boy. Um, silhouette of Mari? Mari's ghost? <sighs> okay. Oh. Oh, Basil. White space. Am I gonna be going back to Amori now? Is Nick going to become Amor Amori? <clears throat> I don't know. Even I don't even know what's going on anymore. What the hell is the deal with, like? I don't. I don't even know, man. I don't even know anymore. Okay! Mmm. My shadow has eyes. That's some inner demon shit right there. Jesus. Welcome to White Space. Ah, we're back here again. You've been living here as long, for as long as you can, can remember. This seems all too familiar. What is this, the third time I've heard this now? And I'm back to Amori. I could stab again, but nah, I'm good. Jeez, could I really just skip like a whole another aspect of the game if I just immediately stabbed and went back to freaking um Nick? Or actually, when I came back the first time, I don't think stab was an option yet, but now I just have it all the time. Hmm. Well, let's leave. 
Or can I leave? Am I gonna have to, like, wait for something to fall? Oh, no, I can just immediately go. Okay. So, white space is my home. I don't understand. Like, is this all just, like, imagination? Or... I don't get it. Oh, hey, guys. Oh, Aubrey, you're back to being nice. Mori, welcome back! See here, I told you not to worry. Mori always shows up when we need him. Is everything okay, Mori? We were worried about you. Now that you're here, let's go out and look for Bazil. He's counting on us. Be patient, Kel. We have to make sure that Mori is okay first. I'm good. Maybe you and Hera can go yourselves. Um, okay. Come on, Mori, let's go exploring together. Just the two of us. Aw, oh, okay. Hey, you can't leave us out on- leave us out of this. He's right, Oppie. We have to do this together as a team. You never know when you'll need someone's help. We're stronger than when we work together. Hmm. <laughs> Omori and I will be fine on our own. You'll protect me, won't you, Omori? Ew, gross. Get a room. Come on, Aubrey. It's time for to get serious now. Let's go tell Mario that Omori is okay. You know how she's always worrying about him. Okay, okay, fine. I was just trying to have a little fun. Okay, then. Give me my allowance. Oh, you're just gonna say something? Or no, that's right, I have to... Going out of Mori, here's, here's my allowance for the day. 750. Damn, I'm getting Mori's day. Damn. I... Sick. Alright, so... Where to now? Shut up, random calls. Alright, you know what? I will figure out where to go next time. So, actually, you know what? No, I'll extend this a little bit more, because I want to find a save point. Um... So, where is there to go now? We explored the space land. And... Yeah, oh, well, duh. Mari's right here with her picnic basket. Doi. Hi, Mari. Look, Amori's here. Amori! Aw. Hugs. Stop disappearing like that. You know my heart can't take it. Aw, I'm sorry, Amari. Hmm. So there's still no sign of Brazil? Where could he be? We're not sure. We've been looking for him everywhere and still nothing. <sighs> I hope Brazil is okay. I miss him so much. Yeah, I miss hearing him talk about all the stuff he's into. Like the, all the flower stuff, and the photo stuff, and the art stuff, and the reading stuff. My hair is so tangly. I, w I miss when Brazil used to brush my hair. Mari, will you brush it for me? <laughs> well, I miss when Mozilla used to remind me to wash my hands. Look, they're so dirty. Ew, Kel! Kel, you should probably wash your hands anyway. Everyone, I know it's tough right now, but we have to stay positive. We should all try to be like Bazil. Even when Bazil is upset, he always manages to smile. So, is there anywhere you haven't checked yet? Or there's that other long ladder. Well, there's a forest west of the stump, but it's close and full of spiders. Ugh. Ugh, yeah, same. Spiders, yeah, same. Well, you know what that means. Once again, it's time to face your fears, little brother. And that means you too, Harrow. <laughs> Come on, big bro, you can't back out now. It's just like how the, it is with Omori. We're here to spur you all the way. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> I'm just being silly. Don't worry, guys. If anyone or anything tries to hurt you, I'll smash it out of the way. You can count on it. And don't forget about me. I'll always be there to help, too. Yeah, yeah. We can do this together. L let's go to the forest with most of the stump. Lead the way, Omori. Hell yeah. Well... We will do that next time, so... We all have full health, right? Yes, okay, so I don't need to heal, so... I'm gonna do a little bit of a save-save. Yes. I'd like to keep Omori and Nick's things separate, because why not? Uh, still on three days left, huh? I guess that's the part of the game, I guess. It's not relative to Nick. Anyway. Woo! This is getting interesting. I mean, I know they say it all, I say that all the time, but like, the more horror st I, I do not like the horror stuff, but I also do like it because it makes it more interesting, but also it's horror stuff, so scary. <laughs> um, but the horror stuff is definitely making it more interesting, and yeah, the, the, the cycle, because at the beginning, I, it was like all cute and stuff for a while, and I was like, oh, when's the horror gonna kick in? And then it finally did, and it's like, oh, okay, that was a little bit, and then it got more cutie, and I'm like, it's probably lying me into a false sense of security. And then the whole thing with, like, Nick and fighting the something, like, that was definitely, like, whoa. <laughs> and, like, the thing with Bazel, like, with Nick, like, where he just, in the bathroom, like, ah, <laughs> scary. Uh, but anyway, we'll, we'll find 
Brazil in this world, and hopefully everything will be okay. So, anyway, I'm gonna leave it here. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Bye!